Hey guys, and welcome back to Jedi Survivor. My name is Twitchy, and we are playing the role of Cal Kestis here. Last Ray time, like we went all we the way around in a great big circle to try and open up some shortcuts, and shortcuts we did indeed open. Mostly, I want to show you this nice little uh, pushed down bit of rock over here. We went out that way, we went down through some caves, and we managed to come up through this little back alley over here. I'm just going to leave the droids and the uh, stormtroopers fighting each other because they don't really have a lot to do with what I'm doing right now. And, you know, I'd rather leave my two enemies fighting amongst themselves than get, get all messed up in it and have to deal with things myself. It would be very good for uh, building skill points up. I don't know where this goes. I just kind of wanted to jump up here. I wonder what goes down there as well. I think we might... Hello? Let's try not to end up like that guy. What happened there? Let's walk up and have a look. I don't want to end up like that guy, but... oh. Oh, that's that's kind of like that's that's a bit brutal. That's a bit brutal. He's he spotted me. I think he has. I'm gonna pull a lightsaber out and then do a little uh, jump, jump, jump. Oh, I jumped. I pressed X. I pressed X several times. Why? Why are you telling me no? <laughs> Whoa, new bad guy. <laughs> Don't tell me I can change my difficulty. I know what I'm doing, game. Leave me alone. He just caught me a little bit off guard. I was walking through the forest, having a lovely time, expecting to see nothing more than a few battle droids. And then suddenly, out of nowhere, a yeti comes along and beats me up. I don't know what that is about. Look, this is the other way that we could go. I feel like I do actually want to go and, and deal with that big bad guy first. I don't know what's going to be up there, but I feel like maybe good parts and upgrades for my boy, Cam here okay let's uh let, let's be a bit more ready this time i'm gonna pull out a lightsaber early look that's where i died so we're gonna go and grab our force powers off of that i would like to yeah select this guy and then get ready to just kind of dodge oh more blocking maybe Whoa. oh that's an undock block wow he he be strong he is very strong wow i'm xing i pressed the button i don't understand what it wants for me maybe we want to change a stance here i don't think that one that double blade is going to work out for me stance is up there thank you very much we're going to change this one for the dual wield i don't i literally no idea whether this is going to help or not but i would Let's like go. to think that it gives me some sort of edge here oh it's actually remembered that he was the thing that killed me this time okay that that's cool let's uh, pull out some lightsabers let, let's just try the blocks. Let's try the... Oh, that's an unblockable. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. We, we got out of the way. Now. Okay. One, two. Is there going to be a third? There is. And then an unblockable to finish. Okay. that That's an attack pattern I can't do much about. One. Okay. Unblock. Wow. I've got to, like, block and dodge every moment. I also need to heal. <laughs> Are we ready for another episode that is nothing but killing this one boss over here? I think I think that might be where we are at. I'm gonna just pull my single lightsaber out. I feel a little bit more agile. Yeah, we're gonna just throw that. That that's fine. Okay, three blocks and a dodge. Oh no, just a dodge. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Bam! Big hit as he was winding up. That's good. Unblockable. I can deal with that. Okay, I like I like the double jump. Oh, that, that was also unblockable. Okay, that's fine. Little, little heal here because get caught by... Oh, no, X is... I, I got him that time. I got him. I cut his arm off. What are you going to do about that, mate? Okay, if we, if we could do things like that, that'd be good. Let's get the heal in and jump out of the way if we can. Another unblockable. Okay, that's good. That's good. I kind of wanted to throw my lightsaber, but I'm out of force power, so okay, that's one. I like this, like, block once and then attack a lot. Okay, good. We got there. We got there. All right. Turns out not the entire episode, but man, that was uh, pretty intense. Pretty intense. Yeah, I'll scan that. Thanks very much. Through the back of my head, BD, really. The Mogu. Mogu? Who knows? Watch out for its grab. Attack after when it is vulnerable. Severing a limb will not stop it. It will become more aggressive and unpredictable. Actually... Severing the limb was a lot easier for me. Uh, the Mogu is a violent predator known for stalking and aggressively assaulting its prey. I did feel assaulted. Creatures akin to the Mogu can be found on planets of varying climate, but their temperament remains largely unchanged. They will seek to grab and slam their targets, lifting and tossing them around. Yet even when injured, a Mogu will not relent. I mean, it, I did actually cut its arm off. So, uh, yeah, I, I understand that maybe it won't give up. Uh, okay, so we've got our wall run of some description here. I don't know if that's all... Wall run or a 
an actual way. I'm, I'm too. I'm too high up. I'm too high up. Ah, now I'm going the other way. Oh no, no. I was kind of thinking I was. Let, let, let's let's take a moment here. I was kind of thinking I was going up those vines to begin with. I thought I was going over there, but then I thought I was going up those vines. But it turns out no, I wanted to go for those. Now that we know what we're doing, maybe we can pull it off a little bit. Uh, smoother? Yeah, much, much nicer. Much nicer. Trying to just, like, dive at the situation can sometimes be, uh, not, not the winner. Not the winner. I do, however, want to look over here. Do we think, ooh, yeah, I'll interact with you. Oh, Thank you very much. Looks like a data disk. What, what is that? Con continue exploring to learn more? Ex uh, continue exploring the galaxy to discover this treasure and who finds it valuable. Okay, I think, I think we can do that. What I really wanted to do, though, was look over this edge without dropping down. <laughs> All right, wow, we, we dropped anyway. That, that's fine. I just wanted to see if there was anything up here, and um, the answer is no. Okay, once again, ignoring the big bad guy. I guess I'm just going to take these guys out pretty quick. I, I kind of wanted to just do it via the power of dodging earlier. But I guess now we're just going to clean them up like this. It's, it does make me sad. It does make me very sad. It's like walking into the into the woods and just killing the foxes because they might occasionally nip your ankles. I, I'm not about it. Not about it. Yeah, okay. Let's slice this open. Let's see what's going on in here. We've got the diligence pommel. Okay, that's nice. That seems a little bit rubbish for coming down here. Oh, look. We've got, we've got other ways we can go that are guarded by the big bad guy. Um, which which makes me sad. I'd rather not come in here and have to deal with him if I could. There was a look. scanning thing here somewhere. Yeah. What have we got? See. The bill mule... Biomore pools. These pools are filled with volcanic mud that bowls up through the fissures from deep beneath the surface. Biomores frequently lounge in these pools, becoming covered in and fortified by the substance. The second skin is very similar to the basalt columns that define the landscape. Okay, well, it makes sense. Are we like, actually, they're covered in the stuff? Is that is that what we're trying to say here? Is he just a s asleep? He seems like he's asleep. Can I Can I just very gently walk around? Oh, I left triggered something that I didn't mean to. Ah. Mate, I don't I don't even want to right now, honestly. If, if we can not, that'd be much better. Hi, how are you doing? I, I really don't want to kill you if I can avoid it. I don't think I'm going to be able to avoid it. And that's the shame. Uh, that was a bad move on my part. Okay. I kind of want to take this out and drop it on him. No, it didn't work. It didn't work. I was kind of hoping that would be the case, Dodge. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Once in the face wasn't good enough for him to run away for. It's a bit over dramatic for a creature that was just stood there, you know? I, w I was trying to just do this without waking him up. Turns out not the way. Okay, we've got to do these in order. Okay, okay. So we, we jump up, we climb up. We run across, we pull that out, and we hopefully can jump up here and grab that. Okay, wall ride this way. I don't know where we're going, but I'm wall riding this way. Top of the top of the ridge. Top of the ridge. So those are the things that I could see on the map. I wonder why those columns are knockable. I really wanted to try and knock them down on top of the biomore's face, just to be like, yes, I've used the environment in the way that the uh, developer wanted us to. But now I'm not sure that that is what the developer wanted us to do, because I tried it, and it just did not work. Okay, running down a... Don't know what that stuff is, but definitely doesn't look safe. Well, this stuff? Bugs? Are they... Are they, are they mm, yeah, I'm just going to avoid that. I think that's probably the way. Uh, is this a force echo that I can... No, we're not pushing them. We're not pulling them. We're not slicing them. It's hard to breathe. I don't know what was... Look, they're blue, though. So what... No. No. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it wants me to do there. Uh, I normally, when I see blue, I think force powers, but... Uh, no oh. Uh, oh. It's uh, all over the floor there, but I do see a thing. Do, do you see that? That little platform over there? I wonder whether that's something we can use. There's some, um, some vines over there as well. Are we traveling from place to place? I feel like that might be the thing that we do. Uh, I do see different ways to go. They're trying to encroach me upwards. Let's have a look. Ah, look, there's a there's a roof roof um, hanger here. That's the roof roots, should we call it? Roof roots. 
I think that's what I'm going for. And we're in to interact with some I'm guessing Z might know about data this. disks. Okay, well, we can hope that Z knows about this. Uh, drop down. Really? Drop down. Are you, are you sure that's the way I want to go? It still looks like I should be going over that way somehow. So it's up and right. I see, I see the up. So we're gonna we're gonna go with the up. I'm get. Oh no! I'm guessing that this is for when I drop down and bad things happen. How, what am I supposed to do there? Wait, what am I supposed to do there? May, maybe that was the point of using the the force push. We we can, but hope I'm going to find out at some point. Uh, I don't know when, but you know we we will find out at some point. So I'm guessing I've already got the data disk. Let's have a look in my inventory and see. We've got two data disks. So so yes, I've already got the data disk from this place. So I'm just going to carry on forwards rather than going back over there. Absolutely no need. Uh, drop down to the wall and then we move across sideways. This looks like something that's going to pull away from me at some point. Or is there just to keep the uh, developers amused with the funny shapes that they can draw? Maybe. I don't know. If this substance has anything to do with you. Maybe. Cobra dust. Holodive vol highly volatile matter unique to the system of the galaxy. Without further analysis, the elements comprising this gaseous substance remain a mystery. Is that a gas? That that, that looks like particle matter. I, I I don't I don't think that's a gas. No pu push. No 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 push powers. I really really felt like that was the way. Uh, I'm not going up that way either. Am I running around a wall? Am I where, where am I supposed to be going? It says behind me almost entirely. So, ah, it's the platform I saw. Bounce. Okay. Got, got, to, got to get that flip in. Jedi flip. It's totally not a double jump. Okay, I see a wall ride or a Jedi run. I don't know what they want to call it. Uh, but it's, uh, yeah, it's doable. Oh, cow was about to slip off the wall there. Not not about it. Look, there was another wall I could use, but I think we're fine doing it the way we do. Okay, what? Well, oh. So this is the work of Santari Kree. Be boo. The rest of the story is true. The key to Tantalor should be around here somewhere. What is Tantalor, and why do we need the key? There's a thing to blow up a bunch of... Like roller mines or something. I guess I'm just dropping down here. I'm always wary of dropping in somewhere where I can't go back. But I think now's the time. It nearly killed me. It nearly decided that that was far enough for me to, to perish from. Uh, we can do that. I don't know why I'd want to do that. But we can do that. This is an examine. Wait, what? What are we examining? I don't know. Let's run around in that circle and try that again. Let's do that again. We, we, we pull that. We stay here. There it, the, the, what are we examining? The array feeds into that central tower. Maybe that's where we'll find answers. The array fields, feeds into the central tower. That one there. I also feel like that might be where we find some answers. Got a lot. What's, what's the right trigger about? Push. Okay. All right. So this whole area is full of... BD, where are you going? BD, where are you going? Scan it? Okay, we'll scan it. This whole area is full of the dust. No cutting through this stuff. And I don't think we can get through it. An impenetrable barrier of highly magnetized dust-like matter. Standard manipulation is ineffective in its structure, providing resistance even to a lightsaber. I mean, I've not tried this, so I mean, but, oh, yep. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be affected by my lightsaber at all. Very unusual. What's this stuff made out of? I would like a, a set of armor made out of it. That, if that's possible. Um, do I not want to use the workbench? I don't know. I don't know. We could run down the central bit easy enough. Okay, yeah. I, I think that's where we're going to go. I, there was another climb round area. Am I safe walking down here? Feels like maybe. They've put windows up. What are these guys? Or do I have to be... I'm going to get my lightsaber out anyway. Do I have to be wary? Are you really charging me? I'd rather you didn't. Oh, I, I hit the wrong button there. I was like, hey, let's just jump over them and dodge. But uh, no, turns out I'm just going to throw my lightsaber. Not allowed through here either. I heard you. I heard you. Thank you. All right. 
Um, I can't go this way, so obviously we're going to have to go the way that we pushed the bridge down just a second ago. I did want to explore the quote-unquote obvious path, though. Where does this go as well? You can see that, that trigger point over there. Is there a rope around? I don't see one, but I'm generally quite blind and there's a lot of downward lines here so there could be a bit of rope hiding in amongst it all but i don't i don't actually see it uh so we're gonna walk this way out across like what is what is that is that a roller mine um interaction point i think it might be power's out this place must have been abandoned and forgotten and forgotten indeed i guess he didn't forget all these years later and she never gave up on her mission we can't let her down uh, indeed, Wooty Woo. Uh, she did not give up on her mission, but she really had no choice. And, I mean, let's be honest, robot, right? She doesn't know how to give up on her mission. Uh, let's go over there. That, that's not true. We've seen plenty of droids that give up on missions in Star Wars. Uh, but I think we're fine. Are we going to be <laughs> fine? <laughs> Whoa. I think we should. I'm hearing some bad guys. Are you, are you hearing the grunts and gruels? Oh, look. There's a stormtrooper over there. What are they doing in this place? I might even heal. I'm in bad shape, buddy. He does it for me because my hands are busy. Okay, that's good. What is the size of that bird? I think that creature is trapped. I can't cut it free. Let's pass under it for now. Let's pass under it for now. Why are we even going anywhere near it? But okay, let's pass under it for now. What are they doing? Look at look at them. What are they doing? Where is this unlocked to? Right back to the meditation point. Okay, that that's cool. That's cool. Uh, I suppose I should technically go and get a heal top up or something. I'm scared. I got a level with you. Kind of scared. Uh, this can I open this? Open. Locked we'll from the other side. Okay, we can do that. I mean. I do that, I mean find the door, find the other side of the door and unlock it. This guy looks like someone I'm going to end up being friends with. Y you know, giant creatures are bound in this. Whoa! Uh, uh, I jumped away from the thing that... I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm pushing. Ooh-wee! I don't know what I was supposed to do there, but I fell and panicked. I fell and panicked. Uh, but as he says, we will help it later. That is most definite. There was a scan point somewhere there. What you got for me? A bit of lore, a bit of story. Thing sheds. Epic Maltings! The Piazza reigns over the skies and plains as one of Kobar's apex predators. A terror to any creature caught in its sights. The nomadic creature rarely perches and its temporary habitation on the forest array may indicate either injury or distress. Okay, I mean, I'm not here for injury or distress. Uh, if we can bring about a minimization of both of those two things i'd be very very grateful oh look we get to open the door hey shortcut yay all about the shortcut so what have we got further around here oh hello something around here has a big appetite yeah i hear what you're saying i'm gonna just like look how sad he looks look how sad he looks i'm just gonna leave him behind i i don't think this is something that we know where what what am i looking at let's go Oh, you. Hello. Oh, no. Oh, I'm very bad at fighting you guys. Slow down time. Jump sideways. Hit it. Oh, we have a few of these. Oh, not you as well, buddy. You see that little one? That little one trying to get involved? I didn't even get it by... Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm trying to heal. <laughs> hmm. Imagine not using the meditation point and then having to run through the entire episode that you had just done again. I mean, who who would do such a thing? That that sounds very, very silly. Come on, buddy. Uh, okay, let's try and see if we can't fight this big bad guy. Uh, it's, I totally haven't forgot who it is we're fighting. That guy over there. It's been, it's been quite quite the little journey. Quite the little... cow. Cow, you're doing all right there, mate. Let's let's pull you back up. I didn't even know you could slip off there like that. Okay, that's fine. I don't know where the shortcut opened up. I, I've I've got a bit, I've got a level with you. I didn't. 
Oh, over there. Okay, let's go use that. Doing all those jumps again, being like, I'm sure I had opened something up so we didn't have to do this. And it turns out, yes, we had indeed opened something up so we didn't have to do this. And we go over here, and then there's also another way open over here. Look at that. Best use of shortcuts yet. Okay, I'm wondering whether I'm going to switch to my jewel-bladed style. I'm definitely dealing with this little guy first because he caused me actually most of the trouble during our fight there. Okay, hello. You gonna be good over there? Can we uh, can we have a, a good time together? Okay, you gonna charge me? He's charging. I'm gonna do one of these and see what he does. Nothing. Nothing useful. I was like, maybe maybe we can do that lightsaber parrying bit, but it turns out no, no, I can't do that lightsaber parrying bit. I was like, let's let's try the maneuvers that we get given. Yeah, no, may maybe not, maybe not. I, I definitely need to practice with this more carefully. This lightsaber stance is what I'm trying to say. Hooey, I've got some slowdown, so let's use that. Okay, it didn't seem to be all that effective. Help, please. Oh, no. No, I can't cut both of his arms off, okay. I'm, I'm trying to run away. Well, not so much run away, but just clear some distance so that I can... Oh, he hurts so hard. He hits so hard. Yeah, no, no more of this dual-bladed stance business. I keep hitting the wrong button and at the wrong time, and it's causing me some troubles. Woo-wee. Let's block and move. It's literally block and dodge. Oh no, I pressed the wrong button twice there. Oh, he's weak. He's weak. I can get in and... Oh, or he could kill me. He just like baits me in. Another stance change. Who, who knows whether it's gonna be helpful or not. Okay, we got a Mortal Kombat on the bridge. I think that's really the way that we're gonna do this. A little dog. More of those. Okay, we, we, that, that was good. Ah, threw my lightsaber at you. What are you going to do about it? And again? <laughs> okay. I mean, that, that's kind of fun, but let's actually try and get some damage here. There, there's an unblockable coming in amongst all of that, I'm fairly sure. He does one, two. Oh, that unblockable. Oh, I'm pressing X. Okay, I've chopped off one of his arms. Woo wee woo. That, that block and then attack business is where it's at, would you believe? Apart from I'm not very good at the, the dodges. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to dodge that one. Woo wee, that was tough. These guys, serious fights. Serious fights. Okay, what are we going to get around? Oh, we're going to scan something. What are we, we going to scan, my friend? We've got some. Graffiti. I've never seen tech like this before. And I scrapped some serious machines on Braca. Yeah, these generators change the air, charge the air, sorry, with highly excited energy currents, similar in both power and danger to interstellar ionic storms. From the looks of the structure's rampant rust and overgrowth, it hasn't been put to use in several decades. Okay, well, I don't, I don't know if we're ever going to put it to use, but let's uh, cling onto the ceiling and see if we can't get our way round here. I'm feeling like we should have a new new shortcut to open after fighting that bad guy. Surely, surely he's just a little bit too much for us. Okay, here's a nice little box for us to grab though. Oh, whoa, that's not how you open a box. Try, try and walk. Oh, uh, no, it turns out it is how you open a box. You just hit it with your lightsaber. And we got the switch of diligence. Okay, I don't know what that blue arc down there is all about, but I guess we're gonna go find out. Hello? I'll scan this, thank you. What have we got? We've seen this tech before, just not on An this scale. Orb amplifier. A curious fixture of High Republic era Jedi technology, these stabilize, focus, and magnify the erratic potential energy stored in the Koba orbs. Is this an orb? Can I can I can I store this orb? Can we pull? I can pull! Okay, that that's good. Now can we put this in here? We can. And now it's just gonna melt its way through here. Just like Look two. at that. Beautiful. And with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you guys next time where I'm actually going to meditate and save this. And we're going to figure out what's beyond this door over here. But I will see you then. Oh, when we're going to do that.
Bye.